What's going on, everyone? It's Taylor Cowles here for CLNS Media. The Patriots filled out their 90-man roster yesterday with a pair of free agent acquisitions, bringing in former 49ers wide receiver Jalen Hurd and former Ravens linebacker Diego Fago. Now, neither player has played an NFL snap in their career, but Hurd has been in the league since 2019. Now, he missed his rookie campaign with a stress fracture in his lower back and then missed the next two seasons with a left ACL injury and didn't play for anybody in 2022. Still, he could be an intriguing piece to the Patriots offense if he's healthy. Hurd showed that he could play both receiver and running back when he was at college at Baylor, where he actually overlapped with Tyquan Thornton for a bit. Now, Hurd is still raw as a receiver, but he showed he could use his six foot four frame to body out other defenders at the catch point, go high for jump balls, and also plow through defenders after the catch, as well as eat up chunks of yards. As a runner, he was mostly a goal line and short yardage back, but did also receive touches on jet sweeps when he was in the slot. Now, while Belichick said that Hurd is going to try out as a receiver for the Patriots, if Hurd can carve out a role on offense, you can be sure that Bill O'Brien is going to maximize that versatility. Now, Fago is a former Navy player, so obviously a Belichick fit, who's known for his intelligence, though he does lack athleticism. Now, last preseason with the Ravens, Fago struggled defensively against the run and pass, but he did pop at times on kickoff. So if he does manage to make the Patriots roster as a dark horse candidate, it would most likely be on their special teams unit, which is already re-bolstered after a lot of acquisitions, both through the draft and free agency. For full Patriots training camp coverage, make sure you subscribe to our Patriots Press Pass YouTube channel. And for all of our written work, make sure to check out our website, clnsmedia.com.